In this video, I will be sharing a few important tips about the Thanksgiving and the Christmas cactus. You will quickly learn how to keep this fun plant growing in your home and or garden year round. Using my pronunciation app on my iPhone, here is how you pronounce the botanical names of these plants. The Christmas cactus or the Schlumberger X breed GCI. Schlumberger X breed GCI. The Thanksgiving cactus or the Schlumberger truncata. Schlumberger truncata. This time of year, I am finding many Thanksgiving cactus with tags saying that they are Christmas cactus. There are two different plants, believe it or not. According to an article I read from the University of Vermont, you can tell the Thanksgiving cactus apart from the Christmas cactus from the shape of its leaves. The leaf segments are serrated or toothy on the former as compared to the more rounded leaf margin of the Christmas cactus. Either way, they're both amazing plants and super easy to take care of in your home and garden. I brought this beautiful Thanksgiving cactus home the other day from Aldi's. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the container it comes in and transplant it into a terracotta container that I enjoy. It's tag Christmas cactus, but telling by the leaves, it's actually a Thanksgiving cactus. Either way, I love the plant and we're gonna go ahead and pot it up to enjoy in my front room. Once I have my new container all ready to go cleaned up and some potting soil on hand, I basically take the plastic container and kind of squeeze it at the bottom. This will help loosen up the soil and if there's any roots coming out the bottom, it will be easier to remove from the plastic container. Gently keep your hand at the base of the plant, holding up those lower branches and kind of keeping it stable in that new container while you fill in potting soil if needed around the edges of the container. Don't pack the soil too tight. The plant needs a well-drained, loose soil. This potting soil has a little bit of fertilizer in it, but I'm going to go ahead and add a 20-10-20 fertilizer when I water. During the holiday season, I'm going to water mine with a Epsom salt or magnesium sulfate mixture as needed. When summer approaches, I will stop fertilizing. The Thanksgiving and Christmas Christmas cactus commonly drop unopened flower buds, which may be induced by an excess number of buds or a sudden change in temperature, light or other environment factors such as drying out of the growing medium. I like to use a natural dried Spanish moss around some of my houseplants. It just looks neat. If you do this, be sure to move the moss out of the way when watering. Pest and overwatering are two of the biggest factors that can kill this plant. I hope you found this information useful. Please be sure to connect with me on my website and social media at Bren Haas.